Hello everyone, and welcome back to Let's Play Earthbound. I'm Amanda, and we're here in the Monotoli building. We just rescued me from this poor old man who was controlled by the evil Mani Mani statue or whatever that we destroyed. And he is gonna be awesome and let us use his helicopter to go places, so let's go get it. Actually, wait, wait, wait. Nope, there's something else I want to do first. Oh wait, no, never mind. We can we can do that later, I think. I think. Yay, helicopter! What? Hey, where's our helicopter going? That's not cool. That was our next awesome item. <laughs> it's spelled backwards on the other side when it turns around. That's awesome. Yeah, Pokey, you're an asshole like usual. Bah. Bah, humbug. Durr, durr. No helicopter for us. Well, I guess at least he's concerned for the welfare of people. What? Dude, I'm having another one of those episodes. Caesar, Caesar! So we have to go to three. <laughs> we get another uh, ride from the Road A5. Cool. I guess we get their music too. Bum, bum. Now the thing I wanted to get is in here somewhere, not here, but I missed a present in here somewhere. It's something I want to get, I think, because it's better than a stupid sudden guts pill. Here it is. Vital capsule! Yay! Yeah, we're gonna want that. Actually, I'm gonna use that right now, I think. They give it to me because my HP is usually pretty low. It'd be nice to have that go up. Well, we're on our way back down. I have one- They just know when to interrupt me, you know? <laughs> it's kind of hilarious. Hello, Apple Kid. Uh, okay, we get we we get that there's this master Gigas guy we gotta fight, but what the heck is a phase distorter? Oh, so he's gonna go hang out with Jeff's dad. Jeff's failed dad who never visits him. Yes, it would. <laughs> well, we're not getting you any Runway 5 autographs, lady. You are asking too much. But yeah, I have one more question. Angry Poncho asked me, if it's not too personal, it's not really. How old are you? Well, actually my page is not lying at all. I am 26 years old. Not kidding. You know, yeah, I know it's the internet and blah blah blah, you know, if I wanted to pass this 18 or something, I'm sure I could, but you know, what's the point? I was born in 1985. I don't particularly like being 26, it makes me feel really old, but <laughs> whatever, there's older people out there. Derp derp. Yeah. Bus ride, woohoo! Headbang time, guys! Put on your rocker faces, let's go! <laughs> yes, I'm really sitting here bouncing like an absolute idiot and I don't care. It's two in the morning, and I'm hyper! Two in the morning, da 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 Actually, it's 1.59, but close enough! <laughs> Thomas Jefferson, that's never not gonna be funny to me. Oh, 
Come on, guys, boogie with me. Yay, Freed is a happy place. Look how happy it is. It's actually much, much more pleasant this way. With peaceful, nice music. We know, dudes. You were helpful, sort of. Hmm. I don't suppose that's to, supposed to be a giant hit. Hint. Hit. A <laughs> giant hit. Yeah, that'll be their new album out or something. If you guys had absolutely no idea what they're talking about, well, I wouldn't blame you, I guess. But, there's an item here that was crushed to pieces when Jeff showed us what a terrible driver he was. But yes, that's what we have to go and get because we need it. <laughs> you know, you'd think, you know, we could just teleport or whatever, but we, no, don't teleport. I'm telling you. We can, you can get to the same place that we need to go next the same way, but just don't do it, because you're going to go to the wrong spot. Can we not get it? Oh, there's a ladder here. Okay. Well, let me on the ladder, please. Hey, more neon glowy stuff in the middle of nowhere. We missed it, didn't we? Seems like so long ago now or something. Painted? All you did was paint over the damaged parts, and it looks like that? Wow. That's gotta be some impressive paint. You're welcome. And Jeff's gonna check it out. Oh, he still has to fix it. Okay, that makes more sense. Man, that's quite a paint job, don't you think? <laughs> Woohoo! Summers! We were supposed to not go there according to Gygus, so that's where we want to go. But before that, you know, there's something else we gotta do in winters, right? Do you remember what Jeff found there when we were there before? Sanctuary boss! One of my least favorite ones, pretty much. That's just because you guys know how much I friggin' hate mushrooms. Yeah, mushrooms. Now we will enjoy some nice Skyrunner music again, and see if uh, Jeff's driving has improved. Let's hope so, because another crash landing wouldn't be so great. Oops, a present we missed. <laughs> My bad! I guess I'm not- oh, another one! <laughs> I guess I'm not a complete completionist then, since, uh, yeah, I kind of skipped those. <laughs> Oops. Are we there yet? Are we there yet? Does he just, like, want to freak people out by coming down over people's heads and stuff, flying in this spaceship thing? Like, oh my god, aliens! We're under attack! We're going to get abducted! You know, I'd be pretty freaked out if I saw something like that come down out of the sky. I don't know about you guys. Yay, we're finally here. You see why you wanted to go this way instead of teleporting? Because this brings you right here into Dr. Andonut's place. If you go the other way, it would bring you... Outside of Snowwood Boarding House, I think. Oh, monkey love. How cute. Hmm. Yeah, we'll have to check that out sooner or later. I don't think we need to check it out right now, though. We just need to go to that dang sanctuary boss. And yeah, you're gonna want to do that while you're here. Definitely. That's right. <laughs> wow, what a thing to just randomly tell someone you just meet. Jeff wets his bed sometimes. Poor Jeff. 
How embarrassed he must be to have his dad just say crap like that about him when his dad didn't even come to visit him. <sighs> yes, rainy circle. That's our next sanctuary spot, and we're gonna go there. Oh, how nice. But not donuts, huh? Alright, alright. I know some of you are probably like, Why did you leave that gift up there? I'll get it now. Broken pipe. I don't remember what this turns into. But we'll find out sooner or later. It might be the shield killer. Well, I'm not sure. Actually, we probably didn't need that, but whatever. I don't think we're actually going to have time for Rainy Circle in this episode, but... Wait, we need something, don't we? Do we have it? I'll check in a second. You, I think you want the pencil eraser here, and I think it's the last time you're going to have to use it. Oh good, we do have it. We also have friggin' trout yogurt, which seems pretty pointless. But yeah, whatever. Oh yeah, I want to give her. I want to give me my stuff back. Sorry, Jeff. How do I unequip that? Oh, take it off. None. There we go. Um. Wait, I don't have anything to switch these with, do I? Ooh, dur. This might not be very smart of me. We'll see. Wait. He doesn't have room for those, does he? In his inventory. Oh, of course he does, because they're just not equipped. Whatever. Yeah, I derped out, whatever. Oh, he has room. I forgot, we wasted all those bottle rockets that didn't work. Equip that, and I'll hand him over. Defense. Oh, she does have other stuff. Okay, cool. Yeah, yeah, I know. Boring stuff with items. So thrilling. So thrilling. Hehe. <laughs> Bracelet. I think that's about all we need to do with that. I could give her the night pendant, but I'm gonna pass on that for now. She's got enough defense with this other stuff. Oh wow, his defense is really high. <laughs> okay, nice. Well, we can deal with that then. And since we're running out of time here, I'll just start heading there, but I think we've got about all we need here. And we just gotta go up here to fight the next sanctuary boss. There are these cave boys out here you can fight if you want, I think, but I'm not gonna bother. So, we'll just head in here, and I think we can go right to him. So yeah, if, you, if you're... Unsure of whether you're gonna make it through this battle or not, you'll wanna have saved there in Dr. Anonut's place so you can just come right back and try again. I don't know what level you're supposed to be to get this guy, but I know you're supposed to do it now. So, since we're running out of time here, uh, we'll just leave it right here, and next time we will get our next sanctuary location from one of my least favorite sanctuary location bosses! Woohoo! Anyway, this has been Manda with Let's Play Earthbound. I will see you next time! Bye-bye!